Good morning, I'm uh, Thierry Thea, um, co-founder of WeCube. WeCube is uh, basically a startup grower and company growth enabler. So basically, we help startups to grow, to develop their network, their strategy, and uh, their client base. I would say um, one of the differentiators is our uh, strong entrepreneurial spirit. We started WeCube from uh, scratch by basically ourselves, a uh, team of uh, co-founders who are also uh, involved in different kinds of businesses. So unlike other accelerators or incubators which are I would say maybe subsidiaries of big companies uh, or uh, of a strong um, uh, big uh, association. We are really uh, entrepreneurs that are doing uh, growth enablers for other entrepreneurs. So um, since we have a strong uh, entrepreneurship uh, spirit, um, the entrepreneurship uh, mindset is really at the uh, center of uh, WeCube. We basically want to uh, stay innovative, uh, creative, and um, we bring a collaborative uh, work style. We would like to see WeCube um, everywhere, of course, um, not only in the Philippines, but also regionally, uh, in Cambodia, Vietnam, Malaysia, Singapore, Hong Kong, um, maybe even in Europe or in the US. If we can make WeCube a Filipino uh, initiative that becomes worldwide, we will be very proud of ourselves. Um, however, we, we need to go step by step. Uh, and uh, the uh, next step would be to have more of uh, WeCube spaces in Manila, and then Davao, Cebu, Palawan, that would be uh, some of the uh, immediate objectives. So I believe everyone could have a different uh, definition of a startup. As far as we are concerned and as far as I'm concerned, uh, for me a startup is an initiative from anyone um, that has a dream and that would like to transform it into a company, an activity that is sustainable. Well, um, as far as we're concerned, um, we believe that it's important to, uh, to have dreams and to uh, convert them into uh, real um, projects and to make them become materialized and this is the reason why we would like to help startups because we need to uh, continue to, um, to, to grow uh, entrepreneurs um, this is really the, the heart of the economy the heart of uh, the uh, business activities so without entrepreneurs there won't be creativity there won't be innovation and uh, there will uh, I mean, there, there will not be a, a self-renewable uh, uh, activities. So we would really like to contribute to grow uh, startups um, by helping young entrepreneurs or young dreamers to achieve their dream. Um, there's, of course, a lot of uh, different uh, characteristics. And um, just to pick a few, I would say they need to be uh, ambitious, uh, they need to have a strong perseverance, to basically always uh, have a strong will, uh, not be accepting uh, defeat and uh, failure, but to learn from it. Um, and also to be able to uh, step back and take a look at what they are doing, um, look at the issues, the problems, um, ask for help if they need, if they need be. Um, and uh, be able to adapt. I think the most important part is to be able to adapt to the environment because it, we are in an ever-changing environment. So the other um, characteristic would be to be a good team player. You cannot do anything by yourself, uh, even if you are uh, Mark Zuckerberg or uh, Bill Gates. They have strong teams, they have advisors, uh, financials, so basically, um, the most important is to be able to build up a strong team. Well, um, I would say that um, the dream is important, the objective is important, the idea and uh, the uh, ability to innovate is very, very important. But the most important of all um, is execution. If you are not able to uh, execute 
your uh, business plan, um, if you do have a business plan, um, then you won't be able to go very far. So um, somebody said that uh, success is really uh, based on uh, uh, maybe 10% of a good idea and 90% of strong execution or perfect execution. There will not be maybe perfect execution, but at least you need to be able to, uh, to move forward and to uh, overcome uh, all the obstacles that will come along the way. Um, actually, it's a very good question. Um, I would say that uh, I'm always motivated whatever I will do. Um, so it's probably uh, natural. I um, don't think I will have a real source of motivation except maybe to contribute to, uh, to uh, live uh, maybe the, uh, the earth uh, better when uh, I will not be here anymore. So um, the uh, feeling of uh, and the, uh, and the uh, importance of uh, leaving a legacy, something that will stay after we, are, uh, we become ashes, is one motivation and the other of course is uh, to, uh, to, 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 to help uh, people uh, achieve uh, better life, uh, whether it is my family, my uh, employees, uh, my partners, uh, suppliers, clients, this is uh, being able to bring uh, happiness around uh, is, is, is one strong motivation. Um, I would say um, that they need to be very uh, motivated, um, they need to be able to, uh, to uh, maintain their self-discipline. Uh, um, and uh, they need to uh, look at the long way. Uh, being an entrepreneur or being a startup founder does not mean that uh, you have, you, you're excited and uh, motivated uh, in, the, in the very beginning and then you will, force, uh, you will uh, for sure going to be uh, successful. You will have a lot of issues, a lot of problems and uh, you need to be able to, uh, to, uh, to pull down to uh, look at the uh, solutions and uh, to accept uh, the fact that sometimes it will be very, very hard. You might want to, uh, to uh, basically uh, give up, but that's when you will want to give up. That's, that's really at that point that you have to be very, very motivated and uh, continue. I would say uh, most of the time of the day, I get a lot of work done. However, probably in the morning. Well, I've had a lot of night out uh, when I was younger. And uh, now that I'm a father and a husband, I tend to stay more uh, at, night, uh, at night at home. It's a very good question. Um, and uh, I think um, if I can, uh, make a lot of people happy, um, that would be a very good skill uh, to have. Spend time with my daughter is uh, one of the best time uh, de-stress. Um, otherwise, having a good massage, foot massage especially, um, and uh, relaxing with my wife, that's a uh, good quality time. I'm a Taurus, so I would say a bull, so I always move uh, forward. I really don't listen to music uh, when I'm working. I used to listen to a lot of music again when I was young. Uh, now, actually, I need to be able to download music and uh, I count off uh, my younger peers to give me some uh, good music. Well, if I am in Europe, I would say uh, kebab, I mean a uh, Greek sandwich. Um, in Asia, uh, that would be uh, McDonald's or Burger King. Um, I just go to the shower, get the shower done, and then I'm ready. If money was no object, um, I would say having fun, enjoying life, uh, and looking after what we can do for the next uh, generation. Uh, 
An app that can do anything, well, I would say I would develop two apps. One that can make everybody uh, happy um, anytime you will uh, check your app or consult your app. The other one would be um, that, uh, that an app that can answer all your questions and find you anything you need at the cheapest uh, cost at the nearest place from you.